Hello, Abiola David is my name. Welcome to my Power BI lecture video. In this lecture video, we are going to learn how to import multiple CSV, comma separated value files, into Power BI. Let's get started. So I'm going to come to this get data drop down under the external data group. So I'm going to come to more. All right. Having click on more, I'm going to see from folder because my CSV is actually located in a folder. Then I'm going to connect to that particular folder. Okay. Now we're going to see in a moment. So I'm going to click on folder and click on connect. Now I need to provide the location of that particular folder where my data is actually stored. So I'm going to click on browse. And of course, the name of the folder is last. And the name of the main folder is CSV. Click OK and OK. So the Power BI will begin to evaluate through the folder to be able to bring out all the data stored in the CSV. Now we have this option, and you discover that we have extension that are .csv and .xlsx so i'm going to click on not combine but i'm going to click on transform data now the power bi power query editor will be opened and i can do so many transformations that i need in there before we combine the files together okay all right this is the power query power bi editor so i'm going to come to extension and i'm going to filter out the dot xl sx then i'm going to remove all the columns and click on the content then i'm going to click on this double downward pointed arrow and of course we can see that the query is being evaluated and we're going to see the combine files dialog box for us to combine together all right okay so we can see the combined files and so i'm going to click on ok now so all the three csv files has been combined and if any other csv files comes into that particular folder it will automatically be picked up okay all right we are almost through and of course we can always name our property let's call it sales underscore data enter and of course these are all the applied steps you know that was generated so we can actually go back to each steps okay so we can see the file that has been combined thank you for watching my video more video coming up bye for now